my skin is so bad and it makes me just want to stay in bed all day but I know that exercise will help all my problems seem less of a problem so I'm going to the gym and even if I'm just there for 20 minutes like that's my mindset right now even if I just get there at least it's getting there and not laying in bed I'm really excited because I'm I have a photo shoot with my dear friend Zoe Laz and Ashley Jensen and I love shooting with both of them. Zoe I have not shot with for like seriously six months so I'm really excited to shoot with her and I haven't seen her in a really long time so I'm really excited to see her and I'll like video some of that, that as well later but I need to like get ready for it and pick out outfits and stuff so we will see. I'm also getting so excited for Andrew and I to go to Arizona in like two and a half weeks. And I ordered like a bunch of some suits and like clothes online and stuff. And I'm really excited for them to get here and I might just save them all. And before we leave on the trip, I'll do like a clothing haul video of them. <laughs> on my floor of maybes but I'm just gonna do my makeup and then go meet Zoe at her place and see what she's wearing and like try and figure out outfits hopefully she can help me because I don't know what to do <laughs> because my brother gets married in a week, which is crazy, but yeah, so I'm gonna be with my family today. My grandparents are coming in from Portland. So yeah, I'm excited. Okay, so it's been a day. I barely vlogged any of it. I don't think I'll ever learn. It is like, it's hard to vlog when you're in public and people are looking at you. I just like don't know how people do it, but someday I'll figure it out. After the shoot, I got home and I ate a Chick-fil-A chicken wrap with a cookies and cream milkshake. 
and it was really yummy i know i'm so full i'm just gonna like lay on the ground and pat my tummy but that's pretty much all for today guys Hey guys, so it's Tuesday. Normally on Tuesdays I upload a video, but I literally haven't vlogged anything. It's just been a very busy week, like my family's in town and we've had a lot of like shoots that were unplanned and like rescheduled and stuff. So I've just been really busy and haven't really like felt like vlogging anything if that makes sense but good news i think in my first ever vlog i talked about the dog that lives in the apartment above us and i was talking about how it barks and howls all day and like they just keep it in a cage and like we're trying to figure it out so it's been like weeks so it's been like weeks of me emailing my management and trying to get it figured out and last week, she I finally got an email back from my management saying that they got a legal notice to give to the tenant above us um, to say that they like need to fix the problem, like they have three days to comply and like put it in doggy daycare or something, or then like they have to get rid of the dog. Which during those three days or three or four days, the dog wasn't barking at all. Like I think they actually figured out the problem. But then today I woke up because the dog just started barking and it started barking for hours like it normally does. And so I emailed the management and she called me and she said that since like they haven't solved the problem or whatever, they're sending them another legal notice today from their attorney that they have to actually get rid of the dog. And she also told me that normally, like when you tell the tenant that they have to remove the dog from the apartment, they actually just go with the dog. Which like makes me happy, but at the same time, like I hope that they just sell the dog and the dog finds like a better owner because I just don't want this dog to be abused any longer. Like seriously, it's been like weeks of me calling the cops and animal control and literally them saying that they can't do anything about it. Like there's nothing to do. And I just like don't even, like I was on the phone with animal control today before I emailed my management and I was just like, what do I do? And he's like, well, if it's an apartment complex and the dog is in their home and it's not outside of the home, like, there's nothing you can do. And I'm just like, why? Like, what if I, what if I'm worried about the dog? Like, what if I suspect animal abuse? And he, and he literally was just like, there's nothing we can do. If that was a kid, if that was like a human being, then they'd probably be like, oh, like, we'll figure it out, whatever. But because it's a dog, it's just like, no, like, we don't care. And I'm confused and I hate it but anyways it's like good news but at the same time I hope that they just sell the dog instead of just like relocate because that dog deserves better owners that will actually take care of him Okay, I'm just gonna do it one more time. <laughs> okay, we're done.